time when your father's not home and I'm with your mother. Alright, here we are. 605 North in Los Angeles, California. What car would the rental company give me other than try to break the stigma that I'm a Honda person and they go, okay, yeah, here's your 2017 Honda Civic. And you know what? I kind of like it. All right, I don't know about Irwindale, dude. I didn't come into the town last time we were here. We just went to the Speedway for the Hoonigan Burnyard Bash. But I just drove past a street parked Maserati next to a mismatched color body panel Del Sol. I can't quite put my finger on what this place is about. Is it a bunch of really rich people or is it just the slums? Is it both at the same time? I don't know what's going on, dude. But we're here. It's 1241. I feel like it's seven o'clock. I'm running on two hours of sleep. We gotta go catch a media briefing at 1.30 at Irwindale Speedway. So I go on the track and get some sick pictures. It's probably fine. I don't think I like this rental company. The guy's like, oh yeah, man, I'm gonna give you a discount on the uh, underage driver fee. It's usually $25, but I'll give it to you for 20. And I was like, all right, sick. And then I was reading through the fine print and if you're over 23, it's only $20 anyway. He's like, this one's got the turbo. And I was like, it most certainly doesn't. I think it's got a CVT. There's definitely no turbo there. It's kind of weird though, because I think the head's molded with the turbo flange because the NA car just goes straight into a catalytic converter off what looks like a turbo flange. But at any rate, yeah, not turbo. All right, so let's just get a quick rundown of what happened here. So I got to you save car rental, the place I was supposed to be renting a car from. And um, there was like an hour long wait or longer, according to some people. I was reading their reviews and it's pretty common for them. And they'll nickel and dime me for every little scratch and everything. In fact, when I signed up for it, I was like, how much is your guys' insurance? She's like, you don't have your own insurance? I was like, oh, I do, but I don't want to use it. So whatever, we went through all that and yada yada. Long story short, I didn't have time to wait, so I went to a different rental company. Also not the classiest of them all, but cheaper. And had a car for me to take immediately. Let's get this show on the road. There's the Hoonigan Burnyard. It's full of like demo derby cars and boats right now for some reason. Well, here we are guys. Irwindale Speedway. Got the credentials. Gotta go to the media briefing. Oh, look at that. Solid axle. There's so many Supras everywhere. You get a Supra. You get a Supra. You get a Supra. You get a Supra. So, I have really low battery, but I came over here to find Guitar Center and Sam Ash Guitar Shop and I accidentally found RDBLA. And uh, look at this lowered and wide-bodied uh, Lamborghini Urus right here. That's hot. This is pretty nuts. I don't know about that. We got Gary. Gary, what time of day is the best for an RV? Um, all the time. You know, nighttime, food time, dinner time, time with your mother, time when your father's not home and I'm with your mother. You know the chances. All day, baby. Take it easy. <laughs> so apparently this Nismo 370Z right here has Jeff Jones's wing. All right, so it's officially confirmed that somebody stole the wing off of Jeff Jones' pro car and it's just sitting in a 370Z over there in the parking lot. And the police are here. Somehow somebody stole the wing off of a drift car and made it all the way from the pits on the other side of that racetrack 
out to their car and just put it in there and didn't think that they should probably leave. Gary's really out here. <laughs> 